Earlier I mentioned the idea of a dynamic sculpture and this is uh, an example of that where Magic Spring was this calm meditative pose. This is all moving, turning, and uh, the kind of sculpture that generally is the most successful because it's the most interesting. As you turn it you get this kind of transitional flow because the the figure is in motion. This is called Startle Sky Nymph and the challenge was to create the impression of her being caught in the moment, startled, she turns her head and she's surprised. Now originally when I made the, the drawing it's not that she was surprised because you came up and she didn't notice you there, she was surprised because normally you can't see them and she was very, very surprised that someone actually took notice. So that is, tr the, the, the energy is one of this kind of dynamic movement. The most difficult challenge for this piece was not the action, but it was the wings. When I decided to do this, my biggest concern was how is it going to be possible to make these thin fairy-like wings that flicker in the light and make them believable because they are after all metal not glass if they were um, stained glass that would be the easy part but how to make them metal that thin and have their own little life about them so this was my biggest challenge and we spent a great deal of time as I constructed them to how thin we could make the metal and textured that it wouldn't burn out when we poured uh, the pieces in casting. So no one knew until we got down to the very last step whether we're going to have big holes in them or not because the metal was too thin. Fortunately, uh, the wings survived and so did she. So in the end, here is a sculpture that has a totally different energy from the ones that you've seen up until now.